currently Scott and I, you know, I don't know that we have a relationship. We were ordered by the judge when we were arraigned to not uh, talk to each other directly. We've had an intermediary. I mean, obviously we had some business dealings, so we had to make sure rents got paid and taxes got filed or whatnot. So we, we worked through an intermediary to handle some of those aspects. But, you know, quite honestly, I didn't know when his child was born or if it was a boy or girl, which is sad because we, we were friends. And, uh, you know, I hope that we can continue to be so. I mean, he's got to protect his family and, and his future, as do I. So, um, you know, the current status of our relationship is, um, I guess it's just up in the air. And at some point, you know, uh, we can sit down and, and, and talk about things and, and, and work through them if that's what we need to do. But I hope no animosity. I mean, there's a lot of folks that want me to be upset or uh, just hold some type of ill will towards him and that's not in my character and my nature and uh, you know I'm a big boy and you know uh, I guess the issues that have come about are ones that I'll have to do with on my own and uh, you know we'll, we'll see what the future holds. Well I mean obviously you know I, I pled guilty because I just couldn't continue to fight anymore. I mean I spent a hundred thousand on legal fees. Uh, I, it, it just you know, the, the risk was too great. If, if you agree to go forward and you lose, you're looking at 10 years in jail. If you plead and, and, and try to cooperate, which I did, and then obviously, you know, what we're facing is much less. But, uh, you know, I did sit down with them and, 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 and talk with, you know, the federal government as to the merits of the case. And it was apparent that I don't think they, they saw all the facts of the case, at least as I perceived them to be. And I wish that I would have been given the opportunity to provide additional information to them because maybe they would have seen some things differently. So with that said, if Scott would have continued to go forward, I, I do think that he, he would have had perhaps a better outcome. I think he could have beat the charges in, in court. You know, at least then we know that all the facts could have got out there. And, you know, a jury of your peers hopefully could have seen at least a different viewpoint than, uh, you know, just solely what the federal government had presented.